That's right. That's my garden. It's about a third to half the size of my one I had last year. That's just the beginnings. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. nation that's right it's the dumb luck hunter and right now there's nothing to do as far as in the field right now and as of right now there's really no fish biting because of cold fronts and all the rain we've had and stuff so what do you do with the time and the other part of being a hunter and a fisherman and stuff like that is you try to eat healthy and you try to do those things so what better thing to do than to dig a garden? Check that's it. right, that's my garden. It's about a third to half the size of my one I had last year. That's just the beginnings. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. So oh, yes, in the beginning, there was a garden and hopefully the garden will grow. But anyway, Yes, I'm sweating like a horse. It's a beautiful day, nice and cool, just a soft breeze. What better way to spend the day than out in the yard working on a garden to provide food for your family. And also, I got the turkey heads. They're all playing. Well, I don't know if they're playing or fighting more than anything, but anyway, hey, that's what kids and do. And we are officially finished with digging it up. Now, that doesn't mean we're done. It just means that we're done digging. Now we got to the next couple days, get out here as the soil dries up, take a hoe to it, take a rake to it, a hard garden rake and get all the clumps of grass and all the roots and all that crap out of there. So you don't get all that nonsense whenever the fruit and the fruits of our labor start coming in. But check it out. That's right. And it's not that big, but it's, it's a garden. And yes, I have a chicken wire fence around it to keep the the dogs not out, but to kind of keep them back a little bit so they're not going in and tearing everything up. And all the other dogs have done pretty good, but I'm kind of worried about Millie, my little hound dog who likes to get into everything. So cool thing was, and I didn't get video of it, is I found a snake. I found a garden snake, and that was pretty cool. He had a pretty little thing. It was just, he was probably new, new hatch, probably hatched out recently. She was only about maybe three inches, four inches long, which was awesome. So she was nice and cold, and uh, so I had to turn her loose because I wasn't going to kill her. Those are good snakes. There are good snakes. Uh, she was a good one. Poisonous ones, not so good. Anyway, well, stay deal tuned. Each nation, this is an interesting dilemma. Looks like something wanted my corn feeder more than I did, I guess. Of course, I should have kept my damn camera up because I'd have probably caught who I did it. Or if it was just the wind, because we did have some high winds, but I don't know. Don't know if it works anymore or not, but we'll find out. Stay Ow. tuned. Well, it still works. That's good. <sighs> Man. That hurt. But this is how you do it. So we're going to hit the button again. Hit the test button. And let it do its thing some more. And get out of the way and let it do it. I think I'm going to go ahead and just take it down. <laughs> it's almost empty anyway stuff's been climbing in it and pulling the corn out of it and stuff
So. Yeah, well, we'll just do it by finger. So. See? You just gotta get all that corn out of there, because if you don't, it'll all get gummed up in there. Anyway, what's up, DLH Nation? That's right. I have not forgotten about you. I uh, was just letting you know. I know we hit 150 a couple, couple weeks ago. We hit 150 subscribers. However, uh, haven't been able to do a do a, a challenge or anything lately, uh, just because you know being spring break and everything. Uh, so I put in all the names from all my followers from Instagram and also from my YouTube channel. And I'm just going to let you guys know that I'm going to go ahead and do a, do a giveaway. And the giveaway, the winner of the giveaway, it's kind of ironic because this young man got screwed out of some money because Walmart had some things on sale at the HS uh, Turkey Calls with the plastic horseshoe in it you guys remember that crap from my last couple videos ago uh, yeah he got hosed because he bought the four pack um, anyway this young man somehow some way goes through the algorithm of my Instagram guys and my YouTube channel and uh, Kyle that's right I got you a I got you a, a turkey call buddy um, anyway figured I'd let you either have my uh, purple haze uh, pot and peg call or I'll get you a uh, a mouth call. I'll let you choose tomorrow at school. Anyway, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, DLH Nation, that's right. Um, I forgot to tell you, I'm gonna start a new YouTube channel. It's gonna be strictly be cooking. And it's gonna be cooking a wild game. That's right, wild game. And it will be consistent. It will be once a week, if not twice a week, but mainly once a week. That way you guys can guarantee it'll be happening every week. And uh, I got plenty of stuff in my freezer. I got squirrels. I got raccoons, believe it or not. I got deer. I got everything. So, because I know I put at the beginning of the video that there's big changes coming. There's big changes coming. And that's what it is. It's I'm going to start a new YouTube channel. Be Dumb Luck Cooking. Dumb Luck Hunter Cooking. There you go. Thank you.